Hi there, Simon from simonwoods.com. Uh, today's wine, uh, 2013 Las Chorlas Tempranillo uh, from Arlantha. Uh, now, Arlantha is the bit uh, underneath Ribera del Duero, and uh, I think they grow much the same sort of um, grapes there. Uh, main one is Tempranillo or Tintafino or Tinta del Pais, as it's also known in the, in the region. A little bit of Merlot and Cabernet. Uh, maybe they've got some Grenache as well. Um, but um, th I think this one is 100% Tempranillo. Anyway, uh, let's give it a whirl. There's a slight meaty edge to this. Um, meaty, dark berry plum, but this, uh, yeah, roasted meat and a uh, little bit of blood oozing out of it, which, um, sorry for vegetarians to, uh, to use that analogy, but um, uh, there's something quite, yeah, um, welcome and, uh, yeah, slightly grunty. That's a technical term. Anyway, it, it smells like it's going to have. Um, it's funny because there's a the the, the, the fruit flavour smells slightly soft, squishy strawberries, uh, but there is this meaty edge that's making you think it's going to be a little bit more macho. Yeah, it still feels like those two elements uh, have got some coming to together to do that squidginess and that meatiness. Um, but there's a fresh backbone of um, of acidity. What's the alcohol here? Um, buh, buh, buh. can't see it that side. I'm sure, it must be yeah, thirteen percent. Um, yeah, the finish I'm left with it is really quite fresh, with a slight earthy greenness in there. Not green to the point of it's taking over and it's gone, uh, uh, it's gone horrible and un un unripe. But um, as if it, yeah, it, it, I think two thousand and thirteen wasn't the the warmest of years in 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 the region, and uh, if there was a little bit of rain around, maybe they picked it slightly earlier than they would have liked. But um, it's um, it's an intriguing one. It's one of those that I, I imagine uh, will come out of its shell in the next. I've, I've only just pulled the cork, so it'll come out of its shell in the next uh, uh, couple of hours. So I will report back on that. I find it interesting at the moment, and uh, I'm hoping that it's going to get better than interesting. But um, if it doesn't, or if it does, I'll let you know. See you soon.